Hi, I'm Liz Sneddon. Let's have a look at question 2a part 1 from the 2017 level 2 probability exam. So here is our question. This one's talking about ewes producing lambs and either they have a single lamb or they have twins. So multiple births other than twins are extremely rare. Okay, so they've told us now 65% of merino ewes will produce a lamb that will have a single lamb and of those lambs 86% survive until they're weaned. Then we're told from those that produce twins about one in five lose both lambs and equal numbers of one twin or both twins survive until they are weaned. Okay so this is my scenario and I need to build up a tree diagram. So what I need to think about is the structure. So I need to think, well, what's actually happening? What's the timing of these decisions, the collecting of the information? So first of all, we've got these ewes, and these ewes are going to have a lamb. And so either they are going to have one lamb, or they are going to have twins. That's our first layer of our tree. The next layer of our tree is looking at, well, the second part of the information is about whether these lambs survive until they're weaned. So then we've got to look at whether they survive or whether they don't survive. And if it's twins, we talk about whether two twins survive, whether only one survives, or whether none survive. Okay, so there's our layout of our tree. So that's what we want to build. So let's just do this over here. So we've got our single, and we've got our twin, and we've got survive and not survive, and we've got two survive, we've got one survive, and we've got no survives. Okay, let's look at the information. 65% of ewes will have a single lamb. Okay, 65% will have a single. Okay, then of those lambs, so of those lambs, those of that 65%, 86 will survive till they're weaned. So from the single ones, 86% will survive until they're weaned. So that means we can work out what the other numbers need to be. So 86% and 14%. These are two numbers there. 65% and 35%. Those have to add up to 1. Okay. Next one, from those that produce twins, so now we're on to that second branch of the tree, 1 and 5 lose both lambs. So that's talking about 0 surviving. Okay, so that's 1 and 5. So not surviving, 1 and 5. Or you can write that as 0 0.2. Then approximately equal numbers of one or both twins survive. So equal numbers. So these two numbers here are equal. So if we know that not survive any, none of them surviving is 20%, the remainder is 80%. So then I can work out 80% divided by 2 is 40%. So there's going to be 0 0.4 and 0 0.4. Now what we want to do is we want to work out the different combinations. So I could have a single lamb um, that is born and a single one survives till they're weaned. So in this case I'm going along the branches so I'm going to multiply. So that's 0 0.65 times 0 0.86 and that will give us a value of 0 0.559. And second combination is going along and going single and not survive. So probability of single but not survive. So that's our 0 0.65 times our 0 0.14 and that's going to give us a value of 0 0.091. Third combination, twin where two survive. So probability of twin and two survive. So that's 0.35 times 0 0.4, which will be 0 0.14. Then our next combination is twin where 1 survives. 
it's a probability of twin and one and that's going to be the same because they're equal remember so that's going to be 0 0.14 and lastly we've got our twin when neither survives so twin and neither survives and that's going to be 0.35 times 0.2 which will give a value of 0.07 so there's the setup of our tree diagram okay now I've just made a nice tidy copy so what we want to do now is I just want to look at the actual question so before I even look at the question I need to get this tree diagram set up now I'm going to look into it so find the probability that a ewe gives birth to a single lamb that survives until it is weaned so we're talking from all the different combinations so when I look at these different combinations here I want to look at the single lamb that survives so in that case that's going to be this one here okay um, a single lamb that survives so all I need to do is write down probability a single one surviving is 0 0.559 getting to that answer gets us our U for achieved thanks for watching feel free to visit my website and subscribe to the channel um, linked below and there's also a link there to the rest of the playlist of videos going through these answers.